the new Gore-Tex three-layer CNET technology is a new product which we have developed. We are replacing our current or bringing a new product to our current uh, Gore-Tex portfolio. And uh, it is a product where we are using one of our yeah, well-known, most known, most proven and reliable membranes. And we combine it with face textiles and with a very new and innovative packer textile. It is something very unique, very new. It's a circular knit. It's a 60 gauge knit, so it means it's 60 needles per inch. So it's a very dense and tight knitted textile. It's out of a polyamide 6.6 yarn. So that means it's very abrasion resistant and it's out of 15 denier yarns. So it's really super thin, super lightweight. And some people might know the construction from hosiery or pandy hose. So if you can see it, how thin it is, how light it is, it's hopefully really, really visible. And it's the first time in the outdoor industry that something like this has actually been laminated in a composite, in a three-layer laminate uh, for outdoor technology and outdoor fabrics. This new technology is used for hiking trekking or in the hiking trekking segment for outdoor end use. But in the snow sport end use, it's also being used for touring, for free ride skiing, or for the all mountain consumer, you see. So we have done lots of fitness for use testing to make sure that the product can be used in hiking, trekking, and in free ride and all mountain applications. Fitness for use, is it's not a fitness for use technology. And fitness for use for us means that we're doing all the work to make sure that the product in the end really works in the intended end use. So the target is that when we say this product works for hiking, trekking or for free ride and all mountain skiing, we put the product into the end use. <laughs> we are doing laminates, we are putting them into garment form, we are giving them out to consumers, to testers and we really run them in the field for up to 12 months to get enough and as much hours on it as possible before we evaluate the products, we look at the products, we take everything back, we take it apart and look at it and see if it really performs. And that in the end means when it withstands all these tests, when it withstands the lab tests and the field tests, we would say yes, the product is fitness for use.